Hello and welcome to the beginning of the year TI teacher training. My name is Monica Nolan and I am one of your three fabulous TI experts for the 2020-2021 school year. Before we begin, I did want to let you know that we are here to assist you in understanding the TEI process. However, we may not have an answer to every question. If there is a question or a concern, we will assist you as much as possible and or refer you to TEI for questions or concerns we do not know. Teacher performance is the largest bucket of any teacher's evaluations. It informs compensation, career advancement, and how we view ourselves as professionals. TEI cannot stress the importance of teachers understanding how they will be evaluated and the tools associated with that evaluation. During this session, we will look at the evaluation process. TI encourages teachers to be proactive and speak with their administrator if they require additional score clarification. So as you see, after the administrator performs a spot observation, written feedback should be provided to you within two working days and a conference could be recommended. After an extended evaluation, the required um, feedback it should be returned within 10 working days and the same for a conference. Teachers will not, I'm sorry, teachers will notice an increase in spot observations. So pay attention to the red, what's in the red. The additional spots were deemed appropriate as there was no performance or achievement data from the 2019-2020 school term. Spots are informative and are intended to grow teachers. Thus, please talk with your administrator and ensure that you are getting the most out of your spots. If you are receiving low scores, talk with them, find out what you can do differently or which areas you should um, be focusing on to improve those scores. The summative evaluation is a reflection of the teacher's growth throughout the year in all four domains of the teacher's performance rubric. Spots and extended observations along with artifacts inform the results of the evaluation. Teachers um, receive written electronic feedback and in-person summative conferences. There are multiple evaluations, observations during the year. Spots, extended, and inform informal observations are intended to identify areas for growth. That means they do not factor into the teacher's score on the scorecard. The score is only derived from the summative evaluation. Spots are undifferentiated based on effectiveness level. A novice teacher or new to the district will receive a minimum of eight spots. Those who are proficient receive a minimum of six and a distinguished teacher have a minimum of four spot observations. All teachers receive an extended observation. A reminder that the scores on the observation are not averaged for your summative. All right, and here is the performance rubric. Um, I would suggest that you be, make yourself comfortable and um, understand what components your administrator is looking for when they come in to do your spots and or your um, evaluation. All right, and I just wanna say thank you for your time. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask uh, Mr. Hastings Ms. George and myself, Mrs. Nolan, are here to assist you. And here are some additional um, telephone numbers and emails you could use as well. Thank you for your time.